Hey everybody, this is Donna Spring Chicken. The big news, of course, is how absolutely radiant and fabulous that Kate Middleton looks, of course, within 24 hours after giving birth. Now, of course, because she looks so good, there is suspect for, um, from people that believe to look like that, she actually had the baby before and has recovered, which may explain why Prince William was in the attitude of, oh, let's kind of get this over with, and the queen didn't rush down to see her new great grandchild. Anyway, for now, we're going to bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines of today. Jane Obama, we call him. He has the flip-floppers. That flip-flop Obama, which I basically, I think I carry flip-flop Obama on trips with this, so. Oh. And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, you would believe it because John McCain is continually condemning the Republicans on every issue. Um, and, 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 and this morning, John McCain gave up his hold on the Obama butt kisser that's basically currently the head of uh, the chief of staff for the for the military. He said, "Well, we're only going to get uh, we're only going to get garbage, and he's never going to tell us what we want to hear. So I'm just giving up on my hold." Which means the president of the United States told him, "Stop! If you're going to if I'm going to support you for the senator's job in Arizona, you'd better once again do what I want." So, but they did. McCain did get the message yesterday. McCain and those other people all of a sudden were told by the lobbyists and by businesses, it's not a good idea for us to target 50 Republicans for removal. Uh, no. No, they said that, uh, that the businesses said, no, that's totally wrong, and the lobbyists said, uh, let's see, we are trying to put Democrats in the people that are willing to vote to support the president's issues in red districts. Uh, he said, they'll laugh us out of the country. So. That, that his plan to remove 50 Republicans, he said, well, there was no plan to remove 50 Republicans. There was a move to convince the people that put him in office that they were being, they were trying to hurt our nation over immigration. Okay, Republicans don't, Republicans want immigration reform and there's nothing about reform in the program, nothing. Mm -hmm. And Obama and Congress square off over NSA authority amendment and defense bill. Democrats are gonna, Democrats have enough support that they are flat out going to get the NSA, that thing that gave the NSA unlimited power is going to be removed. I mean, they, like they, they had, I said, one of the Democrats was a Republican supporter in, this, in the Senate. He said, uh, can you tell me why you need the phone information on every person in the United States? Said, well, we, we're storing it. You know, we don't, we don't listen to anything. We're just storing it so that, that it can be used to backtrack. And they said, well, he said, if your guy, he said, I, I realized that I'm not very bright other than the fact that I worked for the CIA in the military for 20 years before I become a senator. He said, something that happened 20 years is, go, is not going to do any good for something that happens 10 days in the future. Mm -hmm. You need to know what's happening then, not backwards. So there's no reason to retain all that information. Mm -hmm. And then the Republican said, he said, uh, he said you, you know, of course, that that if I know who you, if I have a phone number of whom you called, and I know how long you called, I can take an educated guess that you're probably talking to somebody you're doing business with or a close friend. And he said, that information is being kept by you, isn't it? Well, it's just, it, it's, it's just recorded automatically. We don't know. And he said, I would know. <laughs> so, yeah. And Wiener admits explicit texting after House exit now expects to be president in 2016. Oh, absolutely. His wife is now supporting him wholeheartedly because she knows that he will now be, he will, he is now assured of getting the Democratic Party's complete uh, support for being mayor and then going up against Hillary in 2016. That she would basically, she wants to be the first foreign born uh, president's wife in the history of our nation. So that, that she's also a left, she's also an Indian socialist. So that basically she can guide our country to a better world. Uh, and the, and they, they said the problem is, is that everybody knows yesterday was National Wiener Day. Mm -hmm. And they caught him again. Um, I, I love it. They, um, I watched it last night. He said, how many times are we going to see this guy without his pants on before the people get the idea this guy is a sexual pervert? He said, "This," she said, "this man would be in a jail cell if he wasn't a member of the Democratic Party, and mm -hmm. he still is expected to win the mayorship of the city." Which they, they said that. <laughs> they, was, 
They, they said, he is a pervert. I mean, she said, I would not want this guy near my kids. See, part of it is after the first Wiener Gate. Okay, you stop doing that. He not only didn't stop, he continued on. Oh, he, he's Carlos Danger. Who's Carlos Danger? That's his new name is Carlos Danger. <laughs> but he didn't send nude pictures of himself out to everyone, just to selective young women. Oh, gosh. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I mean, that they did nothing but... Okay, last night I was listening at the news people on most of the channels. They said they, they couldn't have... Okay, it was really a bad news day until the new Wiener Gate came out on National Wiener Day. So, <laughs> They said, you don't think it didn't come out for a reason on that date? <laughs> Nobody got it. I put it on Instagram, Facebook. Nobody I know. Got we'll it. have to explain it to them. The press you know about it. Republicans will shut down government to halt Obamacare. Oh, no. And John McCain said, we're going to put, we're going to sit, fix this so it's not going to happen. I mean, I heard last night somebody calling Bill O'Reilly. He wanted to know, he said, I... He said he was a young Republican. He said, uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna explain this until you understand it. You think that hurting people is perfectly acceptable. Uh, he said, what we wanna do is to make certain that they don't get hurt. You say, well, let them get hurt and they'll learn their lesson. They said they elected this man to office to begin with. They didn't learn, didn't they not elect him twice after knowing the first time what he was? Mm -hmm. and he said, but you say, well, let them get hurt and they will learn their lesson. And then you'll be able to end it by, you know, uh, uh, by doing it, you know, by a vote. They said, we're going to end it. We're going to stop his funding. He said, well, you can't do that. Do it. Let the people, do, you know, get hurt. And the guy said, want to know what world you lived in, O'Reilly. I mean, I, I'm guessing that when, when, uh, Rod, when Miller comes on, he's going to, he said, you actually told a congressman, well, let the people get hurt by letting it come into place. And then they'll know what they've done wrong. And he said, and he said, okay, let your kid burn his hand in the oven a hundred times if necessary until he's no longer able to use his hand to teach him a lesson. He said, that's, that's, that's stupid. Stupid. And Instagram launches embed feature for videos, photos, and start sharing. I, I don't understand that. I mean... I haven't been able to figure out the Instagram thing anyway. And I, I know that basically there is a method of doing Instagrams to more than one place, but it's really not really set up well for that at the moment. Until that happens, what they're hoping is, well, the embedding feature will then allow you to move it around. Uh -oh. Why not just allow you to be able to move it around like on Twitter? I know, like I can do multiple accounts on Twitter. You can send it to as many people as you want, but on Instagram, you're, you're stuck to one thing and one thing only. And Egypt unrest, U.S. to go ahead with F-16 jets delivery. I mean, they're totally, this president, um, he's determined he's going to have modern military equipment in the hands of people that want to overthrow the Jewish state. Uh -huh. And Smithfield CEO, China deal won't hurt food safety. Well, we know it hurts food safety. <laughs> That's why there's pigs going down the Yangtze River. They basically have no internal security like we do. They have no FDA. You can expect, okay, the, here's the trick here. They bring a zillion tons of stuff into this country a year. They only test so much of it. And the trick is we've got an awful lot of things, bad things coming in from China in food. Mm -hmm. like, does everybody know that apple juice tend to come from China because of the time of year that they... The, the apples are in bloom when they, oh. yeah, so. And Blue Cross describes health law impact on premiums. Well, there is no increase. The President of the United States will tell you that the increases are all being made up by the Republicans, even though, uh, oh, what did, what did Flea Obama say? He said that, that we like this one. John Bon Jovi is going to tell people that weren't paying anything for health care before that they need to join a program that will cost them three times what it would cost if they just went and got an insurance policy. Mm -hmm. But he said they're expected to listen to John Bon Jovi. Oh, and Will Ferrell, who's going to use Funny or Die to promote the fact, well, if you weren't paying for it before, it's, uh, it's going to do you, it's going to make, you know, you're going to be doing a service to the country. You're going to be helping, and I, I, like the one guy said once again, I love this. He said if you just simply went out and bought an insurance policy for somebody that wasn't insured, you're going to save twice 
the amount of money that Obama is going to charge you for paying for other people. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Uh, that it does look that you, it does look like that you can say the same thing over and over again, and people will continue to buy it.